Kind of feels like my nuts, you know, when you're. <laughs> what? What? I need another dab. Bro. Nah, my He said. But like, he you said. know, when you're, when you're holding it, it's like almost wrinkly. I'm, it's like next, almost wrinkly, furry next time a little I bit. I fucking have a kiwi in my hand. I'm going to be fucking thinking of Eric. <laughs> no <laughs> doubt. Fuck, no is, doubt. It's <laughs> fucking <laughs> not cool, dude. It's not what I want to Well, just not mine, about. but I'm sure yours as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure like every man's nuts. It's not just, I'm talking about nuts as well. <laughs> Does the bass come off or? Oh, what the <laughs> fuck? Wow. Oh, it's a good torch too. Oh, no fucking torch. shit, yeah, man. Thing. You'll never believe what it's called, bro. Bro, what is this? Why yeah, is this? it's a whippet can. <laughs> <laughs> What's crazy is, man, like, there's literally giant cans like this. People just be inhaling, like, the whippet things. Oh, fuck. I didn't know they made It's like, it's like blowing up again. Yeah, yeah, I didn't know they made butane. They I didn't know they everything. made butane at all, but that's crazy. Whippets are blowing up again. It's kind of crazy. I see a lot more on my timeline. That's that. That's what your brain feel like on that <laughs> shit, bro. I've never done a whippet can, but I've definitely had, like, a few balloons in my day. Really? What are the balloons filled with? I don't even know. Like, I'm uh, the least oxide. educated person on whippets. I'm pretty sure it's not. Isn't it nitrous oxide? Is that what I'm not saying? Oh, yeah. I'm pretty it's positive. Like the it's like the laughing gas? Is that laughing gas? I don't know, but it makes you go, whoa. What the makes fuck? Makes you get this, like, deep voice, too. Oh, <laughs> yeah, shit. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's definitely just, like, a weird drug. It just, drug. like, slows it down or, like. Yeah. Yeah, it's like I, I don't do it. It was like in high school. Yeah, you'd yeah. go to you'd go to high school and uh, like high school party, and there'd be like you just psh, you hear it going yeah, off, and then you'd, you'd be like three for five. Yeah, <laughs> damn, that's a pretty good deal. I mean, is this it is one was, inhale is, is one balloon like one high, or can you get like multiple highs? It definitely does balloon? not. It's not something that lasts a long time. Mm. Did you see people like fucking just? Killing balloons and like falling. Oh, dude, dude, bad, bad. Don't do that. Don't do. Don't do. Don't do that. Bad. Whippets stuff. are bad, man. Bad, bad. Nah, whippets are super bad. Bad. Fun, but bad. What? You can't. Damn. Are they actually fun? I mean, for the we can't for a few seconds. Can't I would definitely. I'm not gonna say it wasn't fun because like I definitely did it and had a good time. Damn. But I would. I wouldn't do like Steve O on whippets. That doesn't look fun. Oh shit! Yeah, like, with the cans everywhere, like that all over the that floor. That gets like yeah, that looks that gets scary. Bad. Looks yeah, depressing. Yeah, yeah, doesn't yeah. really look fun at all. But a balloon at a party? Nah, it's a good time. <laughs> Fuck! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I had a good time. I wasn't. I wasn't trying to Back one in the shot day, the balloon. Do you think it's gotten stronger nowadays, like weed has, like since you've done it? Oh, I never even thought about this. <laughs> It, they, the little cans gotta be stronger, right? It's like compressed. It's like yeah. it's like, oh shit! Concentrated <laughs> fucking whip it. Holy fuck! <laughs> Damn! Now you got me interested. Listen, man, it's episode one oh two of Pine Park After Dark. Man, I'm your host, Eric Carl. We got Tim over here. What up? And it's uh, sponsored by motherfucking Base Smokes. Baby, yes, shout out to our good people over at Base Smokes who are giving out weed right now. They've been giving out weed for weeks and weeks and weeks straight, and they're about to give out weeks more worth of weed man all you got to do is scan the qr code or go to the website and you get a free eighth buddy all you got to do is pay shipping isn't that incredible it's actually insane i've had a lot of people come in the streams like yo i mean i fucking actually got Idaho, that base smokes and i got that free eighth this shit's insane that's <laughs> what i'm saying it's getting them stoned as hell that's all you need man you can get hps as well qps Ooh. you can get motherfucking full p's over on the website it's kind of ridiculous so make sure to check out base smokes shout out to them mm -hmm. for the love man we appreciate for you base the smokes. love we also got a little party coming up. We got a little party coming up. I'm excited, man. I'm excited. August 3rd. Yes. Mark your calendars. One month from now exactly. Is that what I'm looking at? Is today the 3rd? Holy moly. Oh, I guess they're watching this on the 5th, but yes. Yes. Ah, today yes, is the yes, 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 indeed. Very, very excited about it, man. Uh, we're having an unlimited weed party. Is that true, Tim? Is this yeah. true? Yeah. So what we're doing is uh, it's a strainer release. Mm. So the focus is is we're definitely gonna have a good time and, and have some some partying. But we have a strain release for the Pink Passion new strain dropping in the Michigan market. Um, it's with Doghouse, our friends, our family out there. So you know it's some fire. And then we also got three strains of rosin. Where wow. We're dropping as well, we got the Red Cab, we got the AMG, and we got the Hellcat. And all of this, when we say unlimited weed and stuff. Why, why do we say that? Well, if you have a ticket and you come to the event, there's dab bars with the with the rosin to try. There's joint rolling stations. There's bong bars. There's there's other brands coming that are going to let you sample too. Um, so it's just it's going to be a great smoking event with literally just 
smoke as much as you can in, in the, the time uh, that you're at the event. Uh, I'm just, I'm pumped, man. I can't wait to smoke with everybody. And a special thing we added as well, uh, we just added a little Mario Kart challenge. Whoa. If anybody beats me personally, they, uh-huh. get, a, they get a special prize from Doghouse and Pine Park. Wow. So taking all, everybody in there, if you want the smoke, uh, you're not going to beat me. I got one eye and I'm still going to drift all over the place on Damn. you. I'm coming through. I'm hitting you with red shells, blue shells, and green ones. Back up. Because you're not to. winning no prizes. I might let like a couple people just, you know, if I feel bad, like I'm really smoking you, I might just slow down a little bit. But uh, is it going to be like 1v1s or is it like eight? No, like we'll let people, people join in the lobby. Yeah, oh, nice, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice, We'll nice, let nice. people join in. It, uh, probably four at a time. You know, nice, something like yeah, that. that's yeah, controllable. Full. For sure. Yeah, it's going to be good though. It's going to be Ooh. good. Man. I'm excited for some challenges type vibes, man. I'm excited for some good food. There's a bar with Pink Passion drinks too. Wow. No way. We're turning up. Damn. We're turning that's up, a super so. turn We're drinking the smoking right there, man. Uh, we also got something I'm really excited for. That you just informed me about a little Ooh. VIP box, man. Yeah, a little, little VIP box. box. Dude. What? Sick. What's going to be in that bitch, man? So there's a little collector's box if you wanted to like uh, take some product home in like more of like a souvenir type fashion. Oh. So it's a special box. It'll have one gram of each of the, the concentrates that are releasing. Um, it'll have some of the pink passion in there. But then it's also got this super unique. We're not going to release these. You know, so you you can only get it in the box. Yeah, it's a little. Uh, it's kind of like one of these little collectibles. A little figurine. Yeah, a little figurine, but it's a Pine Park doghouse figurine. Damn. And it also doubles as a joint holder too. Damn. Yeah, so that, that little figurine's super fucking sick. Um, but if you want to try all the products, it'll all be in the collector's box. Damn, that's gonna be yeah. exciting, man. A I'm pumped. Figurine. I'm a figurine little whore, man. I can't lie. I love. I love connecting. Oh shit! Well, I hope we get. I hope they made a couple extra. Mm. Fuck, can we not? I'll, Yo, take they better I'll, sneak, I'll buy a box. Yeah, Fuck I was it. like. Hold up, hold up. We might have to get a box, dude. We're copping the box. The exclusive collector's box. Make sure to check that out, man. I'm very excited about it. I'm pumped, man. These flavors are looking exciting, man. I'm just every time I sniff them, is it more exciting? Yeah, dude, dude, dude. Which one is that? The Hellcat. That that shit fucks so hard. Oh that's that's the one. This one is You've taken some home since the last time. But this is the AMG. Oh. This is the AMG right here. This shit's fire as well. That, that Hellcat is, is it's gas, dude. It's super gas. It's, it's literal gas. gas. It's it's like my ideal turps in a jar. Like wow. it's literally just pure gas. Dab that up, man. Man, use that little ray gun you got. Yo, should we fire it you up? You see the name? What is it? Thick it. That is the most. Yo, thick I it. Jose, Jose was like, yo, I got you something. Get and the thick pulls, torch. And he fucking pulls this. Dude, this out. thing is a beast. That'd be an awesome <laughs> gift. That'd be like wow. It's the craziest torch I've ever seen in my life, bro. It feels so weird. Like this is. I feel like I've seen different versions of it too. You know. You've seen this? I've, I've seen no a different shit. ray gun little torch, but I've I think never, it's different. What's great is the stand too, bro. It's, it's a rocket ship. Big ass I think it's a penguin ship. Like, I'm looking. I'm the? seeing penguin. Oh, from like this side, it's totally a penguin, right? I mean, it shit. Could be a just getting creative on it. You know what I mean? Damn, look at that shit. It's actually what absurd. The... <laughs> it doesn't really stay in there, though. I think it's kind of like you put it down. That's true. Cause oh, I... that's. Uh, does it? Oh, nah, it's gonna I mean, fall. yeah, it's going to fall. You just can't shake it, you know? Nice little flame on it, though. It's a good torch. Yeah, I, I don't, like, Sefo. I don't like the small little torches. You know, you can't take dabs with them. Like, you think it's it's like it's a huge form factor like that, and then it's like the baby-ass little... Or it's got, like, the uh, the triple... Yeah, fucking... that bullshit, man. Trash. That's a fucking banger right there. I like that one. I'm hype right now. Wow. So new that, little toy. It much to make me happy. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. A new, new toy torch, always dude. gets me excited. Come on. It's like a toy almost, but it's a useful toy. A tool? A tool, per se? I hit, nice. I hit on the mystery box with this bad boy. Dude. What do you got over there? You I got a little, yeah, I'm just smelling the shit. This isn't the uh, Hellcat anymore. This is, what is this Uh-oh. now? A little bit of Neffs, a little bit of Michigan. I'm just mm-hmm. showing love to Michigan, man. I can't wait to go back. I'm excited. Michigan. Shout out. If you're in Canada, slide your way over. If you're in any of those other states, slide your way over. The Midwest goes hard. We ever been? You ever okay. been to any of the lakes <clears throat> up there? No, no, I haven't been to any lakes. Fuck, Fuck I wonder if they get lit. They probably turn up. Damn. Drinking. Yeah, smoking. yeah, you got to. Damn, we got to go to Canada for sure. Fuck. We got to go to Canada for sure. Canada's cool, man. Canada. You been in Canada? I have not, dude. Whoa. I have not, I have not left the United States. What? Is that true? That, that is that is 100% true. How long did you live in the mountains for? Uh, Like four years? Oh, like man. Yeah, That's I think so. so. Yeah, about four, maybe, maybe five. Four years. Wow. Weird. Would you do it again? Oh, I'd do it tomorrow. Oh. Yeah, 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 I'd do it tomorrow. Oh, shit. Is that 100%. your preferred way of living? You think, like, away yeah. from everyone? Oh, it's so nice, bro. Wow. Damn, that shit's crazy loud. 
Now living on the mountain is so peaceful. Really? But it's like if you don't like that lifestyle, you get bored so fast. Like it's it's, it's like so slow. Mm, you shit. You like that though? Not doing much. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's like it's like, chill. It's peaceful. Like younger, I can understand why it could be a little like crazy. Like you, there's not there's not nothing to do. Like you can't right. you can't uh, even go get fast food. Oh, shit. like there ain't there ain't nothing to do, bro. But if well, you had like a family type shit. Hang animals out with them. and stuff. Mm. That's that's type of like shoot guns. Dang animals, huh? What kind of? Wow, all kinds of animals. I think I'd have like a donkey. Donkeys low key kind of fire animal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like a Shrek kind of donkey. Yo, He's what? Dead, isn't that sad? What do you need? He's dead. What's isn't dead? Sad? Oh, damn. Oh, there's always another puff coat that's somewhere. Crazy man. That was crazy tech right there. I love it. Yeah. I you think you could live on a mountain? Chamber on it, but, mm, Middle of nowhere? Depends on how long. I'd probably lose my mind eventually. Yeah, no, I definitely get a little stir crazy for sure at times. Like when you Is that what you call in. it? Stir crazy? You get a little snowed in, get cabin fever. Oh, a lot of different words. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, bro. Like there was one little spot. Like it was like a like a man-made bridge you had to get, get over. And it fucking stormed and that shit got washed out. So I legit couldn't leave the property. What the like fuck? I just couldn't leave until somebody with a bigger tractor could come and fix it. Damn, bro! Imagine if you didn't have enough food. What would you? Do? What the fuck? I gotta walk <laughs> fucking six hours. Like nah. you gotta hunt, bro. You got or you got chickens and shit. Right? You gotta eat. Damn, them. low key, we would have had to kill them or just eat eggs. Oh, you just had them for the eggs, huh? You didn't really. No, I killed a few chickens. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, or some of them. Is it kind of sad? Because <laughs> you like. Yeah, I didn't like it. I didn't like that at all. Yeah. I fuck fucking, yeah. I figured out, I was like, oh, I'm not, I'm not built for that shit. Yeah, I found yeah. out real quick. I was like, oh, I got sad. I, I, I legit, I had, I shed a tear the first time I killed a, a chicken for sure. I was like, damn, this is sad. It's like your pet. I mean, you, you. Nah, I didn't kill the ones I liked. No, <laughs> no, nah, fuck that. No. There's ones you liked? Yeah, there was, there was for sure like uh, one or two that would like run up to me like, like a, like a dog or something. Like, oh, you come into the area. Wow. Picture. Jump and you could recognize them, like yeah, you for sure, hundred percent. Wow, <laughs> from other chickens. <laughs> Some chickens were assholes. Those motherfuckers got their head chopped off. Sorry, we ate those motherfuckers. <laughs> Damn. Then you're like shoving your fist in its ass. And like, hey, Yo, in like, oh. its ass is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, where else do you put it, man? Right in the ass. Oh man, yeah. I've never. That sounds. Have cool, you ever? Though. Have you ever cool. like uh, like killed an animal to eat it, like a fish? A chicken. Yeah, but I didn't like process. Not process at all. Yeah. No? No, okay. No, no, no. But you've like you've you've like have you hunted? But yeah, yeah. Just once. Okay, so life. you've you've sh you've shot the animal, but never like you didn't. Yeah, do, we didn't do like, the whole skin thing. it or like do anything like that. I don't know if like I've done it with like chicken and a turkey. I don't know if I could do a bigger animal, bro. Like that shit is. Like if I had to, I guess, but it's not something that like some people could just do it. Mm -hmm. I don't got that. Like it. it I feel like it's maybe easier if you're eating it for sure. You know. No, nah, like that's like how I justified it. Of it. It's like, that's man, how I justified it when yeah. I was doing it. I was like, no, nah, I'm about to eat this. Like, mm -hmm. it's feeding my family. Like, that's how oh, I was trying to. But then in my head, I was like, shit. I was like, nah, oh, this is crazy. <laughs> like, this really, is insane. Do you get a lot of chicken off of one chicken? It's like, I mean, two breasts. Depends, two breasts. It depends, I guess. Like it depends. Wings, but, yeah, it's not like. I mean, you've uh, you've ordered. I mean, go go get a rotisserie chicken from you the. You can fucking, order a full chicken. Yeah, it's like fucking six dollars at the grocery store, bro. Isn't that shit crazy? That's fucking insane. But they sell them for a loss, though. That's how they. It's, that's the loss leader at really? grocery stores. Yeah, 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 you didn't know that. No. So I like, guess that makes sense. All grocery stores genuinely sell rotisserie chicken for a loss, so they could get you in there to buy other items to Whoa. pair to pair to make money off like the sides. Like you gonna get some Hawaiian little bread rolls, make mm. little sandwiches, the cheese. They gonna make money on that. It's crazy. Rotisserie, you, a whole chicken for seven dollars, six dollars is the most mind blowing thing in the world. That is kind of crazy. I saw something about the other day about like what how pineapples are so cheap. Like how are pineapples so cheap? It's like are they? You grow one pineapple per plant, and they Wait. take like forever to grow. Is it really only one per plant? That's what I see. It's not a tree. Wait, how does a pineapple grow? Am I tweaking right now? How the fuck does a very, pineapple I even grow? I think it's grow? very space intensive and like it takes a long time. But I guess it's not labor intensive. I think pineapple's overrated too. I'm not even going. What? Lie. I think it's good, but I think it's overrated. People are like it's the best fruit ever. You're That's tweaking. That's fucking insane. I'm going top five for sure. Top five? Fruits? Sure. 100%. I'll give it top five, but it's not like best fruit ever. People be but saying dude, that and I'm like, you're tweaking. That, but if it's top five, there's like a lot of fruits out there. Uh, is it top five? Yeah. What's no top doubt. five? Hit me with top five. Mm. Straight, straight top five. Number one and two, they, they could be interchangeable. I get it. 
Because it's hard I'm to say number like, one. It's hard yeah, to say number one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going like interchangeable all of them, you know? Like okay, okay, one okay. One to five. Strawberries for sure. Mangoes for sure. Damn, I hate mangoes. I know. That's what? A, I know. I, it's just, that's a me thing. That's a me thing. But there's some mangoes that are bad. That's the thing about mangoes. It's yellow like, or red ones? Whoa, shit. What do you mean, whoa, shit? Jam- I always get them sliced. Like, I've never oh, seen Oh, so you don't one. even know. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> ha, ha, bougie ass Eric over here. Bro, I'm oh, I'm the, sorry. I, I only stands. get them sliced. I'm the mango sorry. Stands, bro, I'm sorry. I only get them sliced. It's, it's whatever the seasoning on those things. It's huh? whatever the homegirl has so on I think the corner those are, of the I think those are uh, red mangoes. I think so. Mm, that's ones the they have. On the, the bigger ones. Shit. The yellow ones are small. Oh. I don't know. I just don't like, I don't know if it's a texture thing for me. I just don't like mangoes. I've never liked them. That's it's fucking weird. All right, That's so you insane. got you got mangoes and strawberries. What else? Ooh, and then I think I gotta go. Damn, I really like kiwis. Green or gold? Dang, green. Okay, gold good. kiwis, huh? Is Never that a rare that. one? No, no. It's not expensive. No, they just be selling in a grocery store. Dang. Normal. Nah, Fire, kiwis though. are cool. Kiwis are cool. Are you weird though? Do you eat the skin? I had that. You're supposed to do that. That's, that's what, what people, people told say. me, bro. That's I'm like, that's say. crazy. There's no way. That's There's crazy. No when way, someone man. told me that, I was they're like, all furry some, and shit. This is some TikTok bullshit. Yeah. If you, when I learned today on TikTok, fuck you. It kind of feels like my nuts. You know when you. <laughs> what? What? I need another dab. Bro. Nah, my what? bad. Man. He said. But like, he you said. know when you're when you're holding it, it's like almost wrinkly. I'm, it's like next, almost wrinkly, furry next time a little I bit. I fucking have a kiwi in my hand. I'm gonna be fucking thinking of Eric. No doubt. There's no doubt. It's fucking not cool, dude. It's not what I want. Well, just not mine. But I'm sure yours as well. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure like every man's nuts. It's not just. I'm talking about nuts in general. I guess I should have just said a ball sack. You know, not my. Yeah, ball you specifically sack. said your nuts, bro. I was like, what the fuck? I meant a nut. Now, but you never had a golden one, though. I feel like maybe I've had you one. Had but I don't you, know. The yellow. Had. Mm. They sell them. If they own, they don't sell them. It's always in a little container. There's only like one farm that grow the, the golden one. Shit, then probably. I think not. they grow them in Australia. What? But it's it's, it's in every fucking. Oh, they're no, in all it's the stores. Yeah, oh. it's normal. Nah, I don't know. that would make sense. Australia kiwi. Australian kiwi. No, the kiwis. Oh, they're called uh, kiwis. They're whole. Is that, is that like their state or like their country's little fucking continents? Is it? A, it's all of it. The country <laughs> and a continent. <laughs> I think Australia is a country and a continent. I'm so high. I think. I think you're valid. Shit. Now I think I want Google a kiwi. Now, now I gotta go. All right, well, you, give me the fifth one though, because oh, we're way fuck. off. Um, fuck. I said pineapple in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I did. No, so pineapple is your fifth one then, right? You said strawberry. You said kiwis. Mangoes. Mangoes. Pineapple. Pineapples. I didn't see this. Oh fuck. Ah oh, shit. Top five is kind of hard of anything, honestly. I gotta really gotta think. There's just like an array of fruit. I'm trying to think of all the fruit. There's just too many. Maybe bananas. I don't know. Just because I'm being like strawberry banana smoothies. Nah, I fuck with smoothies, dude. Damn, smoothies mixing those incredible. together. Smoothies are so fucking expensive, though, man. It's so stupid. How much, to, is, how much is a smoothie? What do you mean so expensive? I mean, you can make them yourself and it's way cheaper. Yeah, but if you sure. go to Jamba Juice and get a large smoothie, it's what is it, $20? Like, nah, it's like 11 That's shitty. 12 it's crazy. Five bucks, bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm yeah, so yeah, cooked yeah. and high off coffee that we just went on a fruit tangent for like 20 minutes. Fruit. Wait, what's your what's your top fruit? Not even top three or five, but like you're um, just like, you're thinking of damn one low key? that you love. One love watermelon. You oh, watermelon. Seeded, nice. seeded watermelon. Hmm. With seeds in is better. I don't know why. Tastes better. Like the little black seeds. Whoa. I want them in there. I don't I, want a seedless one. I don't want it. Dang, what? But it. that's weird. And it like, I don't know. It tastes better to me. I'm sorry. I don't know. And it's got like texture in it. And then there's like watermelons that grow in your stomach and shit after. <laughs> <laughs> it's gross. Mythbusters. Dang, dude. I wonder what they're doing nowadays. That's fucking lit. Mythbusters is insane. Dude. I think Homeboy, one of them, I think one passed away and the other one has a what? YouTube channel. Yeah. What? I That's think the craziest I'm, thing I've ever heard. I'm pretty sure the, the bald guy passed away. Wow, R.I.P. man. Mythbusters yeah, yeah, yeah. is legendary. I don't remember his oh, name. Oh, I feel like I remember seeing that. What the fuck that. is this? This is Serbian basketball, man. This is Serbian basketball. It's a good American crowd. American sports suck. Whoa, chill, this man. This is way cooler. Do this in the NBA. Let's get some flares going, dude. This shit's intense. I feel like Americans would. It's just not allowed. Like, like you ever <laughs> seen... This remind. Like, can we see, like, a crazy soccer game? They go crazy whoa. in soccer. What the fuck? This atmosphere would be, would be insane, dude, with LeBron playing. What the fuck? They're all jumping, linked together. It's a pretty small stadium as well. They're just getting after it. They're turned up. Yeah, imagine like being right here. 
Can't see shit. <laughs> you <been> smoked <laughs> you're, out. You're like, I love this view. It's <laughs> fucking fucking amazing. You cough and you're dying. No, I thought this was the when it said Serbian basketball, I legit thought it was like the Khabib basketball where they like he what? fucking takes your, you have to like you could wrestle. It's like oh. res, it's like wrestling basketball. What the fuck? Yeah, bro, it's fucking weird. You could tackle each other. Shit's fucking sus. Sl- they're like slamming each other on the ground, shooting a ball. Oh, my sports are pretty chill. It's my favorite. It's by far, but it's by. I would love if we can go to the Coliseum, like a real Coliseum battle. Dang, It'd be sick. Bring it back. I mean, the UFC is as close as you're gonna get, huh? Nah, you probably go to some third world country. They probably got something going on that underground type thing. People fighting tigers. We can sign you up. See how confident you really are. If there was legit a tiger fight, we could sign you up for like next week. How confident are you that you you're surviving? Like a full tiger? Yeah, yeah, yeah. like not, <laughs> like like, and it's and it's hungry. Oh, it has. They don't feed it. They only feed it, it who it kills. I think a crowd would hype me up more. I, th- I think right? so too. You'd yeah, be juiced. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. If it was just you'd the jungle, like a boost, I'd be like, get holy a, shit. The dope that you'd get from the crowd would be crazy. If you got like a good hit on it, they'd, be like, <laughs> <laughs> they'd freak out. If you got one good slice on it, it started bleeding and limping a little bit. It was weak. <laughs> they'd be unbelievable, huh? bro. They'd you like, you no might way. turn into Superman. Damn, yeah, that extra adrenaline. Yeah, I'm down. Let's Low do key? it with the crowd. Let's, Let's sign the them crowd. up. All right, so I found a country that's doing where. it. We're going to book the flights this week. It's definitely like <laughs> a Southeast Asia or something, huh? There's somebody doing some fucking crazy fights, like a Coliseum type battle, for sure. For Dude, I saw sure. a cock fight the other day on Twitter. It was insane. Now, you chickens, posted some chickens, weird chickens. shit on Twitter, so I don't know which type of cock chickens, fights you're talking chickens, about, chickens. bro. Oh, I don't know, that, know bro. bro. I know you saw See, that what's crazy is, is is I didn't fucking even I didn't even know about it, and then my fucking stream was like, "Hey, did you see Eric's tweet," and then my mod, my fucking friend, my homie was like, "Tim, it's a sick strain. Go check it out." And I was like, "Damn, Bet. fucking hash, dude. This got motherfucker. You, you. He made me." Go I saw look so at many, it. Like, bruh, bruh. You're a fucking piece of shit, dude. I saw one. It was like. <laughs> I can't believe this guy called Kendrick Lamar seven. He's going up like there's so. <laughs> you psycho man, you fucking psycho. There's dude. some good baits for that one. Hey man, like no way she's a seven, bro. And that was a good one. They were like, "What? Who's a seven? You know what that reminded me of? Is that was like like uh, back in the day when you'd get your friend to click yeah. like one of those links. <laughs> yeah. You get one. You get your friend to click like meatspin.com because you you figured out how to hide links and make it a different that's name the exact or something. Thing shit. I thought of too. That's it. That's one hundred percent. I was dude, I was just laughing. a good classic. Troll. People were pissed. I was like, y'all are being weird for being pissed, bro. Y'all are being fucking weird. That shit's funny. If that shit's not funny, I don't know what to tell you, bro. Like, I'm sorry. That shit Get a sense awesome. of humor. That shit was hilarious. Yeah, that shit was awesome. You know what wasn't awesome? Jerry oh, getting knocked the fuck out. Fuck, dude. Jerry getting knocked the I fuck out. I think Alex really does use use voodoo, bro. Fuck dude, that. Because he knocked him down scary. a third time. He saw when he looked at him and he died at the end of the fight. <laughs> now I'm dead ass. Did you see that? No. Nah. Bro, Yuri was standing in the ring after he got knocked out. And he made eye contact with Alex, and then he fucking stumbled again, bro. <laughs> I swear to God, bro. I swear, bro. That dude's a fucking... He's using some spiritual powers, bro. He's it's got some fair. scary knockout power, It's not huh? fair, bro. It's... it's I, honestly, I tweeted right after. I was like, man, I, I think he beats John Jones. Nah, like, in the no moment, way. in the moment, I was all hyped up and gassed on him. I was like, oh, he But maybe. But then I thought about it. I was like, ah. I Maybe really an s- old fat John Jones. Yeah. No, nah, but it's not even that. It's John will just he's gonna he's gonna ankle pick him and wrestle him. He's gonna wrestle him. He yeah. ain't even gonna engage yeah, with it because yeah, he's just yeah. too. He's just that's his fight IQ is too high. And the second oh, I thought about it longer, and longer, I was, he's not even gonna engage that bro. He's gonna sh- serial gun and just fucking choke him out. Like, but that would be a great fight. I'd love to see that. I'd love to see that. It's gonna be insane. Because what, if, what if Alex catches him? No, <sighs> then I'll be sad. No, I don't no. want to see. I don't want to see Stipe John Jones. Like, no, I fucking don't care. I yeah, just don't, I just do not just fucking really old care. And I just fucking should have happened a long time ago. Kind of action. Yeah, and it's. I'm like such. I'm such a John Jones fan, and it's Same. just like, bro, you suck right now. Like, <laughs> and I know you got injured, and there's nothing we can say about that or whatever. But it's just like relinquish the title or fucking fight someone who's like relevant. Like, when's the last time Stipe even fought? It's probably been two years. Dang, it might be longer than that. Yeah, he really wants Stipe. Does he have the belt? John Jones has the belt right now? Yeah. Wow. And he hasn't fought in like over a year, I think. Dang. And he, the last the last time he fought was Serial Gain, Serial Gone or whatever. Oh, yeah. For like I 10 seconds. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, fuck, man. 
Zero the card was a banger, though. 303 was a banger. I liked it. It was you a good card. So? Yeah, 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 I thought I. it was good, I man. It was I. I thought it was good. Uh, the, I thought what was cool was the the Dan Ige, the co-main event. Mm-hmm. You hear, you, did you hear that storyline? So no, he came he in came on in three, like last minute, three right? hours notice. What? Yeah, he was getting a massage at four o'clock, and he got a, he got a text message, and his phone wouldn't stop blowing up, so he got up from the massage, checked. It was fucking UFC and his coaches saying, we need you to come fight. Cause, uh, he was like down Brian, the street in Vegas? Yeah, he was in, he's a Vegas local. So wow. he was just literally getting a massage, chilling. And he fucking pulled up. And he honestly, he won the third round too, which was crazy. Whoa. Which is crazy. I was like, oh my God, he's about to, he's, he's going to come just back. pulled up. They but just he, didn't give a fuck about the weight or nothing. They're like, just pulled No, up. so they, they had him weigh in at, uh, like literally he came to the thing and they, they weighed in at 165. Oh. Mm. So Diego was supposed to fight at 145. Uh-huh. And then Brian Ortega said, I'm sick. I can't make it. Let's fight at 155. He said, cool, I'll fight at 155. Mm-hmm. And then Ortega literally like three hours before was like, I can't fight. What? Crazy. That's whack as fuck. So it's it's cool of both of these fighters and mad respect to them because they both took this fight on literally three hours notice. It's just insane. Like to that just insane. to just be like, all right, I'll fight anybody. Like that's most people say that, but they're not really about it. Like, yeah, yeah, you got to have like. These motherfuckers were about it. So I respect the fuck out of that shit. A full camp is pretty, pretty chill. I mean, it's pretty important, right? Yeah, like your stamina, sure. bro. Like, what the fuck? Damn, I can't believe Connor wasn't on the card though. That was supposed to be the night, man. That Damn, was supposed to be the fight. Did you see that Bruce Buffer's fight. jacket? No, it was bro! crazy. It was hard as fuck. He had Damn. fucking. He opened it and it had Connor's face stitched into it, and then uh, Michael Chandler's face. <laughs> the shit was hard as fuck, bro. And Bruce was like, he was showing it off, but he was low key sad. He's like, man, he's like, I'm not gonna really get a show. Uh, that shit happened, man. Shit I can't hard, believe it, bro. Didn't. It was what? fucking. Connor sick. got hurt, sick. What happened? Uh, broke his pinky toe. Jeez. And like, like while that's not a, not a, like you would think like, oh, that's a bitch, that's a bitch move or whatever. It's, yeah. It's a hard ass jacket. Um, but the reality is, is if Connor loses again, it's it's over. Yeah. So like him going in with any hindrance is probably not a good idea. Mm-hmm. So like from that aspect, I'm like, maybe he's gone into the last few fights with some, some lingering injuries or whatever, like yeah. the foot or whatever. Maybe it was, was had that fracture before right, right. and to go in again. And if he loses again in another fight or he breaks it, again, it's just, it's just no I way. think it's, I think it's, it's, it's over. It's cooked, huh? So like, he hasn't won in years. He's won like one time in it's years. It's been bad, bro. Jeez. It's it's been bad. So it's like I think I think he made the right decision, no matter how much it sucked, to just like, hey, yo, I'm gonna not fight with even if it's just a broken toe. Right, right, right. right. I'm gonna fight 100. percent Like I don't know. Like that, I'm I'm trying to. Ju- I'm like a fucking Connor fanboy too. Yeah. So I'm trying to justify it for sure. I'm like, no, no, no. <laughs> hold on a second. Hold on. The toe's valid. But it does sound super bitchy, bro. Like it sounds. Pinky so- toe. It sounds so bitchy. Shit, but I mean, you're on your feet and you're jumping back. You know what I mean? Yeah, like like it's literally it's like speed agility. That yeah, that's his yeah, shit, yeah, right? You know. Crazy. So I don't know. I don't fucking know. I'm butthurt about it though, for sure. Like, I just want Connor to fight. I want John Jones to fight. Like, these are the two people that I enjoy fighting. Like, yeah, those are like, yeah, fucking, yeah, come yeah. Those on, are the dude. goats. Those come are the goats. On, We're getting fucking robbed of their fucking prime. At least dude. we can it's watch bullshit. like Alex Pereira in his prime, I guess. Shit. No, we witnessed a goat happen in two years, three years. Like, literally, his run, if he wins the heavyweight title in the next year, honestly, there's nothing you can say that that he wouldn't be the goat. Like how are you he'd be say up anything? there, huh? Automatically, three belts. How are you gonna say anything? In that Damn. small of a time frame, too. Like three. came over and just dominated. He's got two right now, huh? Yeah. Well, he well he doesn't have the the middleweight uh, belt, mm. but he won it. But he mm. won it. He won it when he beat Izzy. Mm-hmm. Um, but he lost. He lost that. Um, or maybe he relinquished it. I don't know. No, Izzy won it back. Yeah, Izzy oh, beat him, yeah, and then yeah. Izzy and lost then Izzy to lost Sean. To, yeah, and then Sean lost to. Duplessis or whatever. He's got the belt right now, Duplessis. Yeah, Damn. he's fighting Izzy now, three hundred five in Australia or Damn. Perth. I think, I think in Perth. I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah. What? That's a banger. I've been a casual. Fuck. I've been summer? trying to get back on my my UFC shit. Yeah, I've been a casual yeah. for the last few months. Shit. So I've been trying to get back on it. I've been trying to get back on. Dude, it. that's gonna be sick. The Izzy yeah. fights can be. I like Izzy a lot. The sickest card. You should you should literally try to go, Eric. Uh, the UFC uh, International No not International Fight Week The Mexican Independence Day Whoa Yeah it's in the sphere he, oh. said, he said Dana White said he's doing it One time only And they said He's he's gonna tell The history of Combat sports Through Mexican history 
What? I was like, that's pretty hard, bro. He said it's gonna be the coolest show that anyone's ever witnessed. <laughs> I, nah, he said he, bro. He said he's already spent twenty million on it, and it, he, there's normally one truck doing the things. He's got four trucks, like with all the cameras. What? So he's got four times the cameras, four times the, the staff. What the Shit's fuck? Shit's gonna go hard. When is it? Uh, three oh six. UFC three oh six. Oh shit! So soon. Yeah, that is kind of soon. September. Ooh. September. Check. That means John Jones. I mean, fucking. Uh, Maybe he's Connor. Before that arc. Maybe oh, Connor. What? You think so? Maybe. Maybe. Dang. I don't tell. think he would want Connor on our card. Maybe because then the yeah, I don't know. You're like wasting like because that card's gonna bang no matter what because it's like a special. Yeah. It's already a special thing. So yeah, you yeah. You don't yeah, need yeah. the two special things on it, I guess. You're right. You're right. But maybe, like, you could be hopeful, right? You could be hopeful. That'd be sick. Ooh, we That'd just be... Need, yeah, I just need to see just that happen again. Just need to see some legends fight again. You know what I mean? Come on. Shout out to the UFC, dude. Try the who? The eighth. Oh, this eighth? What's what do we that? got right here, man? Is that New Pine Park? New Pine Park? I don't know. Is that what they're saying to me? I don't know. You I'm know getting, what we need? We need, like, a little earpiece. In my ear. we like, what is he saying right now? Hold on a second. Dang, it's one single sexy ass nug. Oh, that's got to be the grape, right? Is that what that is? Yeah, that's the grape. The grape nut. Wow, the grape nut. Yo, is it nut or nuts? Because nut is so out of pocket. <laughs> grape nut? <laughs> I'm thinking like a peanut wrapped in grape, you know what I mean? Or grape nuts? What do you mean? I think grape nuts is worse. I think grape nuts is worse. It's like, do you want the testicle or its load? <laughs> You're a sick man, I tell you. You're a sick man. Wait, which one actually is it? Singular or plural? Plural. plural. Oh, so it's nuts. That's cool. You got it. You got it. Oh yeah. Yep. Yep. Hey. It's a pretty. It's a pretty cool design. I can't lie. <laughs> Dang, grape nuts, man. The first trial. Maybe I've tried it before. I don't even remember. Nah, we've definitely smoked this before. Really? I think this is a, the the freshest batch, like a newest harvest of it. The freshest batch. Yeah, I'm pretty positive that's what it is. Don't even get me started right now. I'm going to have to do this real special with my hands kind of vibe. Whoa. It's always nice when you see a random hand up here. And I got a torch, man. I'm just getting handed beautiful things, man. You've got a torch. I've got a torch. We're torched up. Yeah, trying out that new Pine Park. Dude, <clears throat> the Pine Park fucking rosin is crazy. I wish every place... I can't wait for it to be legal, like, federally, so we can just sell that to everybody. You know what I mean? Like, certain I flavors mean to every single person or... Instead of just having our Michigan fans enjoy that, like it's a shame almost, you know? Yeah, I honestly, bro, if this was available here, oh my God, I'd Dang. probably, I'd be like, uh, <laughs> I'm It'd smoking too huh? much of it, guys. <laughs> Put it away. <laughs> It'd be dangerous. Like this strain specifically, the Hellcat is just like, it's exactly the terpene profile that I'm just like, oh my God. God. It's the one you always hunt for. It's the one you always talk about. They don't make a lot of it in rosin. I feel like like right. it, it's they, everything's they, fruity in rosin, huh? Pretty much. Or like, like a lot it's of all it. candy. Yeah, yeah, candy and fruity. It's like there's certain strains that that don't produce uh, when you wash them because mm -hmm. like you got to make hash first to make this rosin. Right. And certain strains just don't fucking produce. So they yeah. just why would they wash them? You know, like right. they're not out here to just lose money. You mm -hmm. know, like they're trying to. Everybody's trying to make some money. In the process of this thing so it's tough that 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 the og doesn't wash as well but i'm always like nah fuck that y'all breed shit bro why can't fit breed the og string that washes well like, there's gotta be at least fig, one y'all yeah, the mad scientists <laughs> figure that shit out I'm, I'm not smart enough to do it i don't know how but there's there's gotta be an og string that that is dumping dumps weight. like maybe it's this maybe it's the hellcat i don't know Dang, i don't know how we well got it, it at pp I can't even believe that. This smells like this. It smells unreal. You're addicted to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll kill, I, dude, I killed two jars of this Hellcat already. Already? Bro. Since last week, man? What do you want me to do? I mean, yeah, you're right. What do you want me to That's do? That's fair. Man? What do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? It's an expensive habit, smoking bud. <clears throat> yeah. Do you, think, do you think it's more expensive to smoke dabs or, or flour? I always, I always ask this to people. Shit. It's definitely a bigger upfront cost for dabs. You know, what do you mean? You can smoke weed out of anything. You can smoke weed out of an apple. All you need is a lighter. But for dabs, you almost need a torch, a banger. Oh, and bigger and upfront cost. Yeah, the, yeah. The, the so like get accessories, started, the accessories get that you yeah, need. Yeah, yeah. But the if you're talking about just the just the actual like, yeah, just material, like, just the material. Let's say you got. Let's say you got a setup. You, got everything. you have a bong and you have a dab rig already, and now you're like, <sighs> I guess it depends I have a how budget. much you smoke. I have a budget. Okay, that makes sense. So I guess it's a little different between everybody. <laughs> yeah, I guess it depends how much you smoke. Okay. Hmm. 
Hmm, yeah, because I mean, a gram of wax is like well, it depends on what wax you're buying too, and if it's good or bad. Yeah. And the weed is, let's say you're buying the best. You're buying the best gram of concentrates and, and the, the best, best eighth. eighth. Which 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 would last you longer personally? I think the concentrate. Oh, that was you, you hesitated. You yeah, hesitated. Hold I think on, the hold concentrate. on. Concentrate, because like realistically, I'm taking like point ones to point two dabs. So that's like five to ten dabs. That's like a few days worth of dabs for sure. I'm taking like two dabs a day. Okay. A few days worth. See, so you're an eighth. You're you're taking a lot of bong hits though. Yeah, I'm taking a lot of bong hits. That eighth might go. How many? How many? How much mm. is that? Like that bong or that bowl? I'm trying to think right now. Actually, is that it's like, a, like point? a half gram? So I probably get like seven bong rips. And I probably take like three seven bong day. rips out of an eighth. I think so. Is that out of pocket? I need to know if that's out of pocket in the that's comments. Reasonable. Somebody in the comments. Is that crazy? That's reasonable. I think. Okay. I think most people would agree. Seven bong rips out of you think that's a lot or a lot of little? I think that's a little. I don't smoke a lot of weed though, but that sounds mm. that sounds like not a lot to me. This is like 0.5 bowls, half gram bowls. Some people put like full gram bowls, so that's really no. only like three fucking. There's not people that are doing like 0.2 bowls or 0.1. I mean, yeah, you could for sure. Like a snap. But I'm just doing realistic numbers, you know. I suppose because we're talking about. 0.1 I'm thinking dabs. the realistic one is is motherfuckers trying to save their their eighth too. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Or like people will try to save their dabs, like take the smallest oh, little take dabs. You know what I mean? Yeah, one. yeah, yeah. Oh. Take less than a 0.1. So it just really depends. It might be equal, honestly. It Seven. might, but they both might last me like two to three days. Exactly. Yeah, there's too many variables, really. I know. Th right? th there's too many variables because you could just go down a rabbit hole with that because every single person is going to have a very different answer to that. It's whatever they want to smoke more. But what's crazy is you smoke an eighth and seven hits. That's that's blowing my mind. I mean, you could roll an that's eighth. In, you could roll mind. an eighth in a blunt and smoke it in. And nah, for sure, for sure, for I mean? sure, for sure. But seven bong rips and eighth is like I'm tweaking on that a little bit. I'm like. Do you hit the? Nah. Do you hit it in one rip? The the point five? Yeah, most of the time. Damn, I feel like you could do it too. It's not that crazy. No, I just. I mean, I guess. I just sounds. <laughs> it just sounds. I crazy. feel like you do do take, and you know, you do take point five ball rips. I don't know. I don't think so. I'll be trying to put the littlest amount possible in that bitch. Mm -hmm. See, but you didn't smoke that whole bowl. There's no way. Yeah, now see, there's like there's. Is that smoked to you? Um, or is there still weed in there? That This I is an important question right here. Like, people, people, would you throw that out right now? Yeah. Oh, people are pissed. Nah, there's no way. People are fighting in the there's comments no right way. now. They're it's pissed. All out, bro. Nah, it's all nah, 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 nah. You think so? Don't there's no out. there's no weed. Like, if you lit that right now, it wouldn't smoke again? I mean, I guess it would light up, but it's but like it lighting up nasty. ash. Yeah. It's all ash. All the turbs are gone. I just soaked them all. <laughs> Damn, people are fighting in the comments for you sure. You think so? You think yeah, there's like more sure. to get like, to like from this? Like, like, empty it in the ashtray. Oh, let's see. Like, is there any, any bit any of... brown or anything? Or if there's any green? So if there's it's no black, if green. it's black, it's not smokable? I don't think so. I mean, I wouldn't want to smoke black shit. Damn, I'd be low-key. I'd be, I'd be hitting it until there's nothing. <laughs> That's crazy. I think people are fucking losing their minds right now. I mean, there's like a hint. Nah. Nah, that's nah, that bro. High school me is freaking out right now. There's no smoke way. that weed. You're wasting it. Like, yeah, it's crazy. there's like a little hint of green right there's here. There's definitely like four or five specks of green and some brown. Here's the green. Nah. I'll put it back in the bowl. No, man. chill, chill, chill. <laughs> <laughs> the comments like, yes, please yeah, smoke we that. Yeah, we smoked in it. <laughs> nah, get that out. Fuck. Nah, that's okay. So, a point five bowl. You probably smoking point three of it. No, dude. but all the terps. No. You're definitely smoking all the flavor off of it. <laughs> it's like eating the pizza toppings. <laughs> <laughs> I do that. I do kinda. that sometimes. No, sure. dude, stop, sometimes. stop, stop. Maybe stop. it's like the last slice. I'm like, stop. Hey, no one else is gonna stop. eat it. <laughs> I'm just gonna eat these six pepperonis and fuck off, guys. <laughs> Be lucky if there's six. There's usually only like three or four. <laughs> question, question. What's the best pepperoni? Is it the the one that lays? It's flat? the ones that are curled up, like the little nipples. Oh man. The opposite nipples. Oh, man. Honestly, it's insane how much better those are. Yeah, they're, they're crispy and they, they hold a little, little oil pockets. Oh, Holy shit. Fuck, they hold a little bit of oil. Awesome. God damn. Pretty awesome. God damn, dude. I'm getting excited. I need a pizza right now. Damn. <laughs> Pizza's pretty good, man. I can fuck with pizza. What's your? What's the one topping you'll never get on pizza that you're just Ooh. vehemently against? Ooh. Damn, low key, it's that's that's the tough one. I really like a lot of... I'll get a Supreme pizza. I got everything on it. Yeah, I love Supremes. Supremes are fuck, good. Fuck, what's one... You like pineapple? I don't mind it on pizza, honestly. I don't mind it. The easy answer is anchovies. 
No way. Oh, I, I didn't even that. think. I hate that so much. I didn't even think about yeah. it. Yeah. That, that didn't even enter my thought process. <laughs> people, the people that get that, you're fucking. I'm like, you're. I just gross. don't even believe it's an option, but like, it's always there. You know, it's no. like anchovy toppings. They've got I don't even like, know what an anchovy tastes like. I've never eaten one. It's got to be fishy. It's got to be salty as fuck, right? It's, it's probably just salty as shit. And some people like that shit. You know who I think like? Some I'm pretty, people like that. Nah, some people like that. I honestly shit. like spam though, so you know what? I wouldn't. Nah, spam's valid. What are you yeah, talking spam's about? Yeah, spam's valid. Nah, but spam people is hate so me. People be hating on spam for the same reason. Nah, they're it's like, just, it's in a can and salty. And they've just never spam. had it. Maybe we just don't, we've we just never had sardines. Yeah, facts. Wait, what's the difference between a sardine and an anchovy? Are they the same thing? I think it's just a different type of fish, right? Oh, I think it's the exact same thing. Damn, I'm. Can we Google it? Sardine Low, versus anchovy. Low key, don't. What did, wait, what did we what did we start with? Did I say anchovies? Did, and I you said, just said sardine right now. Oh, fuck. but I think it's the same thing. I'm tweaking right now. Sardines tend to be light, slightly larger and chubbier. That's a weird word to use for your food. Chubbier? Like a chubby, <laughs> a chubbier food. They're really just mini ass fish, bro. You eat them whole, like face. It's like and a all. little. It's like a little bait fish. Put this on your fishing what fucking hook, bro. Fuck? These are more full fish on the left, dude. Yeah, the, the right one. Anchovies looks, are full ass fish. Anchovies are like not, nah, and people just be eating that, bro. Just sucking them down. That's fucking gross. Sardines are fat as fuck. Yo, if you be eating sardines, oh you're my a, god, you guys they're are like some <laughs> sick fucks, dude. Ew. You're a sick dude, bastard. What the? Fuck? All right, I got the next punishment for when we play a video game. Someone's oh, trying. Someone's trying dude, one of these. Look at this <laughs> shit, man. Fuck. This is unreal. We need a can of this, SFA. Next, whoever loses the next this video game challenge, unreal. I'm probably Just setting myself up. up for failure right here because oh, I'd be losing the video no. games. But. What is that on the right? Oh, They're no, red. No. Canned food. Oh, canned no. food is <laughs> sus. Like you like canned? <laughs> Wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> that reminds me of something. I might, have, I might have to get a little can of that on the right. <laughs> <laughs> you might need a caller. <laughs> Jesus Christ! You having flashbacks? <laughs> Uh, yeah, he My went dicks back. Cut up from the <laughs> <laughs> aluminum. <laughs> it was worth it. It was worth it. I'll go through pain. Canned I mean, food is fucked up, bro. They're really just full ass fish. This is crazy. I can't believe you eat the eyeball and everything. Then they don't have bones. I think they do. I mean, you can just eat through it, I guess. Nah. Whoa. I mean, dude, they're huge. Nah, bro. I'm not. Just putting, <laughs> nah, I'm not just gripping a sardine and eating it, bro. I mean, fucked up. Do you think it's a one biter? Or you, you. Nah, bite people, it? people are definitely one biting these. Like some sick fucks, some oh, sick fucks, god. dude. I bet it explodes. Oh my <laughs> god, I hate it. I hate. Oh, don't do it, Josefo. Oh, watching sardine don't food reactions. Don't do it. I gotta watch people eat some weird ah. shit right now. Some bull, bull cock. Bull. What? People eat bull penis, bro. You just okay. threw that out so casually. I'm down guys, to eat. I'm down to watch people eat some bull cock. <laughs> what the fuck, Dude, Eric? that's the first thing I think of, man. I <laughs> fuck, bro. My bad. My bad, <laughs> The fact that you could just type people eating sardines, bro. This guy adds more salt. Let's more salt is out of pocket. Time. More salt is out of pocket. Why I eat sardines every day for breakfast. That's bait. It's bait. That is some fucking Joe Rogan nonsense, okay? Sardines. Bro science. Trying sardines for the first time. Now, give me one of these shorts. Give me one of these shorts, for sure. Spice sardines? Oh, hell Why? No, bro. Why? Canned sardines in tomato sauce. People are fucking high as fuck, dude. They, some people shouldn't be allowed to cook. You should just be able to get fast food. Like, who's making that? Let's tomato see. sauce? Let's see what this guy thinks. Bro. Is this his first time? Yes, this is his first time. See you, buddy. Oh. What brand is it? Do you think that matters? That probably matters. It probably sure. matters for sure. Yeah, oh, yeah, he started gagging matter. so oh. fast. He started gagging the second he cracked it. Yo, <laughs> he's tweaking right now. Damn, with the fingers. He's going to puke. Oh, he's gonna puke. Yeah, you got to use a fork. There's no <laughs> way you can puke. do it with your fingers. Nah, he's guaranteed he's puking for sure. Okay, I don't want to do this for he's the camera. He's scared. I don't want to do this for the <laughs> <laughs> Bro, what a puss. Just eat that shit. I would have ate it already. He's Ew. making he's making it way harder. He's yeah, making he it way making harder. It harder. You gotta just do it, cause now you're now you're mentally. Oh, you nah, he's man, yeah, he's tweaking. You're he's tweaking, buddy. Tweaking just eat now. that shit, man. No, 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 think about it. Just you think he's faking it for the video at this point? All right, I got a piece. All right. It's like a little piece. That's I could probably do that, but the whole thing. Look, he kind of likes it. Nah, cap. This guy kind of likes it. Rating the sardine flavors. 
See, look. <laughs> I res- you know what? I res- this guy's got the red head- head- headband on, too, looking like the food review dude. I respect it. I give these ones a seven. I respect it. The sardines. <laughs> you held it up to the camera for He's a six. A little salty for me. He's eating it, though. He's eating it, though. This guy's a sick fuck. This one says wild sardines. Oh, oh my fuck no. God. Fuck no. Seven point five. Oh my, look how big that Nah, was. that thing was huge. Five point five. <laughs> Get, like get the one, get face. the one that's seven point five. Oh, we'll try that. He's like slurping it, bro. He finished it. Look at it. He's like, oh, he fucking like seven. He ate the whole thing. He's a disgusting fuck, dude. He looks like somebody that eats sardines. Bandana eats, bro. Shout out. I'm not gonna lie. He looked like somebody that eats sardines for sure. The three day sardine fast. What? That's what it is talking. You know how bad you're gonna smell if all you ate is sardines for three days. It's you're gonna smell on horrible. Beach in Monaco. Damn, these guys are living, man. You're gonna smell fucking gross. Living. Wait, this recipe will make you love sardines. Hey, listen, man, we might have to give sardines bro. a little bit of chance. Eliminate the fear. This video is for you, bro. How to eat canned sardines. <laughs> canned fish files with Matt. Dude, this whole channel is on canned fish. Uh, shout out to them, bro. No way. That's shout niche out to niches. them. That's awesome. They niched down. Oh, shit. Damn, it's just all reviews on canned mackerel and canned bro, pulling, this guy's gonna pulling die. chunky views. <laughs> yeah, this guy's definitely not living that long for sure. That's crazy. Oh my god. Damn, sardine taste test. He's been doing this for five years too. He loves it. Non-stop. Hasn't slowed down. <laughs> Look at his profile picture. His sardines. It's fire. No, his look banner. At his, yeah. his banner is going fucking his banner crazy. Is sick. Whose banner his goes banner so is hard? Sick. This guy eats mushrooms and eats sardines, dude, all day. Yo, hell yeah. These are worth stocking up on. What a beast. I'm almost interested. Oh, no, I'm not interested anymore. YouTube ruins ads, man. Ads ruin everything. But I love a good ad or two. Gotta you know watch on my browser, dude. What are we doing? <gasps> YouTube premium, man. I'm a YouTube premium fan. I seen you posting about that. It's nice. It's not bad, man. People talk about like getting an ad blocker, but you can't get an ad blocker on your TV. I and mean, maybe you could. But you gotta like jailbreak it or like do some weird stuff. Yeah. And an ad blocker on my phone, and I never, you know, and it's an ad block on everything. Yeah, I watch YouTube annoying. on everything. It's pretty yeah. OP. OP, uh, definitely. Super. I like OP. I like watching YouTube more than anything, honestly. So it's yeah, like, for sure. And and I, don't they give you uh, they give music too. I th- yeah, they give you like YouTube. I think yeah, I think they merged YouTube music. So you don't need you don't need two subscriptions anymore. No, I don't think so. so. You can get rid of Spotify. I mean, technically, yeah. I think I think. could just be glazing right now. That'd be gas though. If it had glazing. music, if it had music, it's low key because it's what. It's 12, I mean, I even like watching like YouTube video. Like I think it's music like videos bucks and you can just lock your phone and so that's op too. You're not being. But able that to might lock be a regular it. option now. No, it's not. So no, no, I don't okay. think it's a. You can't close it. You can't close it. I don't think so. Nice. If you don't have the premium thing, nice, yeah, I don't nice. Think so. Feels good. Feels good. I can. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me feel like the premium's worth it, man. Um, we got some news, man. We got some news, man. We'll save this big one for last. Shout out, Brownie, baby. Brazil decriminalizes recreational weed. Ooh, Whoa. that's fucking sick. In a historic move, Brazil's Supreme Court has voted to decri- decriminalize the possession of weed for personal use. Marking. It, the for largest country in the world to do so with a population of over 200 million people. The decision which positions Brazil among the list, the last in Latin America to take such a step promises to reduce the country's immense prison population. Wow, we got to head to like Sao Paulo or something, man. Dude, Brazilian fucking weed. Let's go. Rio. Sounds fucking cool. I want to see the statue, bro. <laughs> So they decrimmed, but is there, do they have store, no store type vibe or anything? Yeah, I guess not. You just got to find it, which is... <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I was asking around for some weed, getting robbed a few times. <laughs> Damn, at knife point, gun point. They have some insane guns over there. Bro. Nah, fuck that. Damn. That's why I see the videos where people like, like the um, like citizens be shooting the robbers back. Oh shit. Brazil yeah. gets insane. I say some of the craziest like dash cams and like CCTV footage is from Brazil for sure. Facts. Some of the most like unbelievable. There should be a GTA Brazil. You getting shot? <laughs> like, might get stabbed. GTA Brazil would be fucked. <clears throat> I'd love like, that though. <laughs> That'd be fun. GTA Brazil would be fucking fun as fuck. Are you kidding me? Yeah, another country in general would be dope. Miami Sick. though, we got that'd be like another. It's like another thirty years out, man. We gotta calm down. We got Jeez. Miami next year. Nah, it's next year. Saying it is crazy though. Oh. RP hopefully. Shout out to Brazil, man. Wow, Brazil would be awesome. 
uh, NASA astronauts are stuck oh, on the ISS after the Boeing Starliner capsule issues. They should have known better. They should have known better, bro. I don't even want to get it. When you go, what's when up Josefo with Boeing, sends man? sends me flight information and says Boeing, I'm like, I heard there's another whistleblower. I don't want to get on that bitch, bro. I feel like there's died. always some Boeing whistleblower dying. I feel like I've heard like two or three stories about it already. I'm just saying, man. Like they're, they're stuck on the ISS. How much food do you think they have? Like enough. They have nah, enough they up there. They, yeah. they fine up there, but they gotta get home. That's the problem. <laughs> bro, they want. They go. are home. They are. Home. Yeah, now they're home. They can't leave, bro. Stupid Boeing. Damn. You think like. I mean, they got to conserve water. You, they're not shaking showers every day. You know, do you think they're chilling? Oh, they're probably stinky. <laughs> you think they're stinky? Yeah. Is that <laughs> just, <laughs> they're probably stinky as hell. Bro. How do you get water up there? You like make it? H2O? Uh, do you want to really know? Sure. Uh, probably recycling their piss. Like through some cleanse? Yeah. Like some filter? Some distill shit, probably. If we're just being like realistic. Dang. You can't waste nothing. That's probably, they probably drink an IP. No. Let's look it up. They got to bring water on the ships or sure. something. <laughs> I mean, they probably got a little bit. They probably got a little bit. Bro, they can bring like a they probably got. Of it they probably the... got a little bit, but I mean like... If you it's ask like, the Russians like now, you, now you're in a situation like this, right? Where yeah, you got to knock on the Russians' door and be like, yo, I'm out of Yo, water. and they're like, <laughs> they're like, brother, we've been drinking piss 20 years. And you're like, fuck. Oh, the crew is not drinking urine. Oh, they don't. They're drinking water that's been reclaimed, filtered, and cleaned. AKA, it, it started as yeah, urine, and now, as, yeah, <laughs> now yeah, science sure. made it water. For sure, for sure. <laughs> There's no doubt. Yeah, see, it's for sure pee. It's for sure pee. But I mean, it's oh not, yeah, NASA says 98 percent of the astronauts' urine and sweat can be recycled. It's like Dune. Have you seen the movie? Yeah, where they wear the little suits and they recycle the water. Oh. Damn, dude, that's crazy, bro. Man. I watched it on the airplane, bro. I saw you watching. I watched it in. in mind you, don't be looking at my. <laughs> don't be looking at my fucking screen, you creepy bitch. It you was kind of, bro. It was impossible. It was like the only screen I could see bro, was like right here. Like, I'm in the window. Next time I see you behind me, I'm, I'm covering my shit, dog. I'm covering my. That's shit. why I have the privacy screen on. You try to my shit. You try it's to like, I know it. people are looking. <laughs> you ever, you ever sync your movie with no screen? I did it with my wife. Oh. with my wife, we've been trying to sync it at the same time. Same nice. Same yeah, 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 yeah. I've done that. I've done that. For sure, no doubt, no doubt. Nah, but that's crazy that they can recycle ninety six percent, bro. Ninety eight, ninety eight. Is that what it said? Nope. Ninety eight. That's fucking wild. They're straight up drinking piss, though. That's fucking weird. I and mean, you're you're just go, you can't think about it. You drinking piss? I think I'd sweat. rather drink piss. No, you're what? drinking it together, combo. <laughs> <laughs> you don't get an option here. It's kid. like both. <laughs> <laughs> it's, not, it's not like a flavor. The sweat choice. water and the piss water. <laughs> Fucking like, violent. Yeah, that, that's so violent. Recycled Fuck. urine aboard the space station. Damn, do you think it's all recycled or do you think they keep it by country? Like you're only drinking your own piss. Or do you think you're drinking a little yeah, bit of Russian? Drinking you're drinking Russian a little piss? bit of Russian piss and, and a little bit of Chinese that piss. Shit, bro. Oh, <laughs> you're getting drunk off that like Russian their, piss. Their filtration's not as good as ours. Hell no, like, it just tastes yeah. like liquor. <laughs> Fuck the <laughs> fuck. I don't give a fuck. What if their homies up there shaking hands and shit? No, nah, they're chilling up there for sure. You're, you're in space. The fuck? Fuck the rules on Earth. <laughs> yeah, we're chilling. No <laughs> what the fuck are we talking about? Yeah, if like the world blew up, you'd just be watching. Like, you'd be oh, chilling. Shit. You'd be the only one. No, you'd die too for sure, but. It would like send you out, like a shockwave would send Hopefully. you out, huh? Hopefully. Oh. Then you're just stuck in this little tube. Damn. You start, you gotta start eating each other. Space is shit. scary. Whoa, what, Eric? You gotta eat people that fast? Holy shit. <laughs> I mean, like, after like, I don't a few wanna get days, a plane crash sure. and survive, dude. Eric's just gonna start eating people immediately. It's like, we just need to chill for like, a hey, week. Hey, we have food. We have Kill food. Kill <laughs> What the fuck, bro? Damn. Oh Eric, we God. had enough food for another two weeks. Yeah, we shit. had food for a month, dude. What the fuck? Just eating the boys. <laughs> My bad. My bad. Oh uh, shit! Yeah, their Starliner air spacecraft after reaching the International Space Station on June sixth, following years of delays and setbacks, now faces a yet another hurdle in their mission. NASA and Boeing have repeatedly postponed the capsule's return to Earth due to a series of technical issues. It's like the worst thing. To yeah, I think I, when I was looking at it, uh, the thrusters are are broken or, or malfunctioning. So there's like five thrusters or something like that, like help them navigate back in yeah. and they're like they're not working bro correctly. that's like the worst that's thing that's like to the ha- most like, important yeah. fucking piece bro what the fuck i guess nah, they're all equally I'd, I'd honestly i'd be like yo elon you gotta send up a ship bro because fuck that i'm not getting on this boeing bullshit that's good pr for elon sending like rescuing these guys 
That would honestly be the coolest shit That'd ever. That'd be the best PR. It'd be the coolest <laughs> fucking shit ever. Elon's got to send a SpaceX fucking missile, or a fu- not a missile, holy shit. Oh, shit. Holy shit. Oh, holy shit. fuck. Holy Blows shit. up the ISS. <laughs> <laughs> it's not cool anymore. <laughs> Sends a fucking insane. spaceship to save these guys because their ship is Do you think he's making broken. weapons like low-key? Like space man, he basically Tesla Iron sure, Man, bro. Right? Like, yeah, I, he has I like mean, the little mini flamethrower. There's no way they didn't make like a fat one for fun, you know? Or that that's not on a robot, you know? What I'm oh saying? yeah, like yeah, they like put it on its arm real quick and see how like funny that is. Mm-hmm. They're all laughing about it. The robots like <laughs> insane. Oh shit, that's how the takeover starts. We're gonna man. be in some weird Terminator shit for sure in the next decade. Damn, one's gonna get yeah, that AI shit's getting crazy. NASA say that the capsule can stay attached to the ISS for 45 days at most. But look, but above that, it says their stay has been extended indefinitely. Oh, you're going <laughs> to die. As engineers work to resolve oh, these problems. Fuck. And Dude. why can it only stay there for 45 days? I don't understand it. It's too much stress or some shit. Yeah, maybe it's. Yeah, I don't know. I don't understand. Maybe there's I'm other people smart. trying to dock. Yo, get out the way. Oh, wait. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> now, that's actually insane, though. It's a, it's a little Boeing, capsule. Boeing just taking Boeing. fucking L's left and right. I keep heating Boeing does up. everything, huh? They do space stuff. They do commercial stuff. They do, like, military stuff. Do everything shitty. Fuck. That's what they do. The Come fuck? on, man. Do you feel hey, safe? this guy's talking when, shit about Boeing. Whenever, they're going to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Whenever you get on a Boeing, though, do you feel safe? I mean, like yeah. You, you, I, don't, I don't let the propaganda get to me, you, man. You, you I'm hear, chilling. You, you, chilling read, you read the check-in, and you're like, Boeing 737 Max. And you're, you're like, like, damn, that's a big-ass plane. That's true. <sighs> you know? <laughs> I'm like, damn, why do we book this bullshit? <laughs> that's what I think of media. I'm like, God damn it. Fucking door is going to fall off for sure, bro. But then you're strapped in. I hardly Do you always wear your seatbelt? Or do you take uh, it off? I, I, I rarely put it on, honestly. I always Damn. sit on it. So they, it You're going to get some asking. turbulence fucking shit. You're going to die. And put my head in the <laughs> ceiling. Just <laughs> like it. Bro, bro. Some yeah, ever since I saw that, I've been putting on my seatbelt. Nah, some turbulence key. just happened, and it threw a guy into the... <laughs> oh, the overhead. Yeah, bro. I said, bro, I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way. That doesn't even make sense, bro. <laughs> it doesn't even it make totally sense. It does, bro. It had to have been empty, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. And then it just opened because the turbulence. And then it sent his bitch ass. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> folded him, bro. Folded him. <laughs> Goddamn, folded him in I'm just trying fucking... to imagine that. That's insane turbulence. Yeah, it had to open him. He had That's to like a roller coaster turbulence. Yeah. Launched him up. And <laughs> Damn, it really, it's like way crazier than a roller coaster, huh? Turbulence is gnarly, dude. Like, it'd be falling like sometimes thousands of feet. Just in seconds. Just, I've been seeing a lot of theme park videos on my feed recently of like, not people dying, but like the stories of it and like theme, like park malfunctions and shit. And like, Wait, oh, what? Shit. What do you mean? Oh, like a ride? Yeah, like the ride malfunctions or like the seat, like the seat cover comes off and they fly out Yo, or something. What kind shit. of videos are you watching? <laughs> Bro, it's just on YouTube and shit. You're watching you know, you death? Know, no, they're not dying, but it's like the videos talking about it, like of the story how are they times. Not? Oh. Yeah, oh, yeah, like oh. after the fact. I was like, like how the are they tragedy not dying? of the so They're, they're you know dying. I mean? Nah, they're dying for sure. Now, I remember uh, uh, as a kid, I was at Raging Waters, I think. Whoa, it's the water that? park. Oh. Th- it's the water park of Six Flags, I think. Mm. And somebody fell off one of the, the rides and they, clo- <gasps> they closed that bitch. <laughs> I was sad. I was pissed. Close it for a day. <laughs> that's it. And it was open. It was open right after. But I was like, that's crazy. I was like, that's cr-. I always thought that was crazy. I was like, motherfucker, somebody just died on that bitch. I ain't getting right. on that. Like that. They gotta uh, like drain the, the water belt, for the sure. Something. failed or something. And it, on the drop, they fell. Do you think you stay in the air for a little bit on that drop? Or like how does like what falls? Work? Yeah, what yeah, falls yeah, first? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not gravity. Both they fall at the same time, right? Oh shit! Yeah, that's yeah, science yeah. class, motherfucker. Damn. Elementary. Right. But one weighs more than the other. I don't think that. And one's like. Getting shoved down. You know? that, it's not free falling. The yeah, other one, yeah, one's on yeah, a track. The other one's on, one's on a track. track. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you're track. just like. It's different. Damn, you fall below. <laughs> Everyone's looking up at your dumb ass. You're fucking in the air. <laughs> That's fucking cursed. That's cursed. Holy it's like your family. Shit. You're like, no. Oh my God. You're like spinning through the air. Oh. <laughs> we're terrible for laughing right now. Jesus. I'm so, we're, we're sorry. We're sorry. Dude, the, <laughs> most, the most fucked up one I saw it was actually in Texas. It was on a video. It went viral. It was that kid that was like, it was on the one that drops. Like the Superman type ride? Yeah, the one that just goes up and down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And his seatbelt went loose. So like on the way down, he like just like splattered on the fuck. It was like someone just like threw him on the ground. Like, bro, it was I just seen a video that just happened that same ride, but the the person didn't fall. Somebody was holding him. 
Oh. His shit came undone, but they was like, nice. Then, Saving his life. They that's was, lit. They was bringing this shit down in slow motion, bro. And it was that's like, shit. no, move that shit. Nah, like, hell he no. Nah. Bring it down slow. Oh, oh you're right. Bro, you're right. You're right. I was, it took a minute to get this shit down. I was like, bro, what if his arm just like gives out? Well, that's fucked. Yeah, you gotta speed it up a nah, little bit. Had, I imagine, do you think it has different speeds? It's probably just like two buttons, like really fast or slow. And then like emergency mode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're just like, holy shit. Oh, shit. It's <laughs> yeah, we, we <laughs> fucked someone up. <laughs> emergency <laughs> mode. Not nah, theme park rides. Theme park Always rides are crazy. Because you're really just trusting like some 16 year old kids to be like, put their thumb in the air and they're like, Ooh. that like, for click, sure. Click, go. Yeah, yeah <laughs> that. The, what's worse is like a carnival. Like, Oh, just like the builder rides. They're like come in a box. They come in a little suitcase. It's and like, just I'm going like, to get on this on. Ferris wheel and y'all motherfuckers put this together while y'all was messed out and drunk. Yeah, that shit's insane. Ah, They go fast, too. Fuck, bro. They go faster than they should. <laughs> all of those There's rides. There's no safety rides. measures, bro. There's no <laughs> safety. And the, yeah, the spinny ones? You go on those. Oh, sp- oh my hell goodness. No, nope. Nope. No, no, no. Carnival rides are sketchy, bro. But I don't like none of that shit. I'd be throwing up. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah those are like the shit. whole ride, like the whole game of Carnival Rides like get dizzy, I guess. I don't get, I don't like that shit. That's yeah. what that, I don't want. I those don't aren't want fun. That. But I like roller coasters. I could I like max out at like two roller coasters and I'm like, alright guys, I'm about to puke hold up. Mm. But I can regain after a puke. I can puke and then feel fine. But I'm really? puking for, for like sure. a few more or are you good? No, nah, I like every like two or three I'm puking for sure. <laughs> but I but I usually would just be like, look guys, I'll hit two. And I'm nice. gonna go play these games right here and get some stuffed animals because nice. that's that's I'm gonna start winning some games. Just doesn't like some stuffed animals, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna walk out with the cotton giant, candy. Giant cotton candy is a vibe Ooh. too. You know what I want? We I feel like we got boring ass cotton candy in America because really? I be seeing these like crazy cotton candy where they be making like shapes and shit. I seen them on YouTube. I don't know what it is. I saw like a guy who was on a tour in There's some, gotta be some one country. Here in, like, Vegas they was making or like. Huh? fucking flowers out of the cotton candy it was it was insane yeah, it was the gotta most be insane one here thing. in vegas or something i bet oh probably vegas yeah, yeah, yeah maybe most definitely vegas uh college enrollment increases in states that legalize weed without hurting graduation rates oh weeds for the kids weeds for the smart people dude weed is not for the kids, all right this is the fifth time i feed this up and not taking it down damn fifth usually co- i'm three at the, the three coffee's oh, got me geeked damn you finished that coffee you finished dressing like two minutes bro yeah i did i don't know what i feel right now I'm that, turned up. I'm turned up off the coffee. Really off the caffeine? Bah! I don't really drink caffeine that often too. So you would think like a little bit would get me like all geeked up. But I think I'm more stoned than caffeinated out right now. Yeah, you're half smoked fucking weed bowl, dude. <laughs> nah, man. You're tripping. He's tripping. He's tripping. It's because I broke it up with my fingies. Because I broke it up with my fingies. It's a little bit tough to smoke that one. College enrollment. That's crazy. A new published study on college enrollment date has found that the adoption of recreational marijuana legalization. I've never heard of this. Acronym. That was the craziest. Oh, fucking sentence right there <laughs> in states increases enrollments by up to nine percent without negatively affecting degree completion or graduation rates i wonder mm. if that like what the margin of error is 9%. yeah i wonder what the correlation yeah. is like, right here yeah and that nine percent is crazy but fuck it i'm taking it. i mean i'm stoked yeah let's do it like, let's do lit. it i'll so take it study hell yeah if it's two percent then it's up to 11 i like that <clears throat> the study also suggests that rml enhances college competitiveness by attracting out-of-state students. Oh, that would make sense. Oh, like no they want to come to a college with weed. With legal weed, legal yeah. Weed. That makes total sense, for mm. sure. Yeah, I could definitely see that. The findings by the University of Oklahoma graduate Ahmed El Batamu, shout out to your uh, studies, my friend, were published in the journal Economic Inquiry. This research builds on previous studies, including a 2022 study indicating that stool- schools in states with legalized marijuana saw larger application posts Without a decline in affluent quality. Wow, that's incredible, man. It's kind of a random fact. That is really random. It's a really random fact, though. But I fuck with that, man. (laughs) It's a little cold. Oh, shit, man. That's the worst when you're heating it up so many times. Ah, Hellcat? You're a Hellcat little animal, man. Is this one going to be called AMG? The Grash It? Yeah, yeah. yeah, Combination. Combination is the the AMG one. How do you say that? Gray shit? Gray shit? That's bad. It's it's got to be like Gratio. You know, the T is silent kind of vibe. <laughs> I'm so stoked. I love this. That's flavor. a good dab right there, my good sir. That's a good dab right there. I'll tell you what. Yep. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I saw this, man. I was tripping about this video, Bro. honestly. <laughs> Dumbasses. In the hot dog is crazy. What are they thinking, man? I mean, that's a sandwich. I don't know if that's a hot dog. They're on like a festival floor right here as well. Like most definitely. They're coming from a festival. This was the stupidest. Yeah, as soon as I saw the dog, I was like, oh, y'all are 
fuck. Yeah. Like, food's not thrown off the dog at all. They're, they, they can yeah, they don't They're give a than shit. That dude, dumbass. No, you can't bring the food. And they said you can't bring the food, so it was like the worst place to even, because yeah. <laughs> you can't bring the food anyway. So what the fuck? Are you what the <laughs> fuck? What the fuck? Oh, okay, like right now, right now, if you're the people, how bad are you tweaking? <clears throat> I mean, like, are you? Yeah, you're, you're tripping out pretty bad. You're like, tri- damn, can I even get back home? Like, homeboy, like I'm homeboy's tripping. texting somebody. He look, he on his phone immediately. The dude in the in the back. He was yeah. on his phone immediately. I'd be like, hey. I'd be like, yo, I'm going to jail. I'd be like, hey, I actually <laughs> don't know these guys. And just like, go catch your flight real quick. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, what's oh, going they're on? so <laughs> fucked. It's a little baby, too. Look at him. He's just learning. It's like his first day on the job. Oh, he's, he's, he's like, getting, I just he's getting these a dumbasses. treat yeah. and a promotion. What a bunch of dummies. He's like, yo, there's fucking weed in there, guys. What a now he's like he he's, he's dog. sitting bro he's he's fucking on their ass. It's a good dog. He's looking like a good dog. What a the bunch of pie. dummies, dude. It's unreal. This is definitely not in America though. Spain. Spain. They be on that ass, dude. They be on that ass, man. Yeah, for real. Cause like it ain't it ain't, like, nice looking airport. In in the TSA, bro, like. They ain't tripping on weed, but they looking for they looking like for like four four joints especially. They like maybe explosive. if you had like a few ounces, they'd be like, wait. No, nah, and like you, you know might honestly I mean? catch a TSA person who like a dick and just yeah, very yeah. anti weed and right, might, right. might hassle your ass and call the police yeah, for sure. But like this type of shit in America, they looking for bombs. Mm-hmm. Like they looking for oh, yeah. they looking for some explosive type. And shit. it was like a few joints. Look at that. It looks bro, so funny, bro. Like that's too? the worst thing to hide. Like, bro, it's not even a good. You didn't even try, bro. <laughs> you didn't even try. Like, you fucking, you suck. This, this sucked. Okay, this. Bro, sucked. I will say accidentally that I've gone through that little like machine where you put your hands up with like shit in my pockets before, and they didn't say anything. Like weed. It wasn't even weed. It was just like a lighter, I think, or like it was something like random. It might have been fucking. I don't even know. And what they it just was. Like, but I just had shit in my and pocket. They just patch it down. No, they just it didn't, didn't even see it. it didn't even flag. Yeah, it didn't even thing. flag. So <laughs> honestly, it, it was an accident though. It wasn't weed at all. It, it might have been like something completely legal. But it, I just it, had it's ninety percent it. a show. Yeah, yeah it's ninety yeah. percent a show, bro. Like for sure. It, it, it it's. I'm glad there is there is. Some hey, shout out TSA though. They're keeping us safe. You know what I mean? They're keeping they're making us safe. you feel safe at least. Fuck. Hey man. Hey man. Then you. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? Bleep that out. Oh hell no! I'm just saying. I'm just saying. If somebody's toes was like this above my head, I'm freaking out. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm freaking out. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I, I'm looking at Josefo and then I'm snapping. I'm letting him know, dude. It's nah, about to go no down. Way. I'm tickling him at least. I'm doing something like I'm fucking with him. Look at that guy's face. What's crazy this is guys they're, like, they're no in first way. class or business or something. They're not in, they in, they in. Yeah, they got some big little seats. Nah, they on a nice. They got two people. Nah, this is a troll. That's gotta be, this is a fake video. Yeah, it's this has like gotta no be a fake way. video. What does she do? She about to. That's what she about to <laughs> what is she doing? She about to oh, smell Oh, she took a little whiff Yo, for sure right there. Nah, she took a whiff for sure. She smelled those toes. That's out of pocket. What is she doing? She got nail polish, I think. Ah, uh, this is fake for sure, then, yeah, right? Yeah, this is fake. So. You think this is a real plane or one of those rental planes? It might. Oh, you're right. It's one of those rental. I hate. I hate. Oh, shit, I hate social for- media, bro. Because I gotta just fucking. This is not even real. Nah, because look, his girlfriend's just cool with it. Yeah, she's like, fuck him. Nah, I don't think this is real. Is it his girlfriend? And then, the, like and then the passenger person, over on the other side person. is just cool too. Nah, this is a this is a set. Don't say that. This is a set. This is a you scam know, video, bro. Know. I know for sure. You could. This is a rental. Two hundred dollars yeah, an hour. Up there. There's nothing up there. It's not real. It's not real. <laughs> <laughs> it's not real. We just got bamboozled. God damn it. <laughs> this video probably went so viral too. Yeah. This probably got so many millions of views. Like on Facebook? Too so many. Dude, 100 million views <laughs> on Facebook for sure. I can't, I can't believe that happened. <laughs> they had Susie, their toes And Susie's up. like, I want this Look, bro, was she have a Bible? Like, what the fuck is that big ass book, that bro? Is a nice what did you read right on the plane? <laughs> hey, chill, man. There's readers on the plane, man. You nah, that was, a, you ain't, that was a huge book, bro. Honestly, that's one of my... That's not a pet peeve, but when they turn the light on and it's all dark and they're reading. I hate when people open the thing. Yeah, open the window, open the window, and it's all dark. I'm like, bruh. Motherfuckers, oh, I hate man. you. Come on. It's, no, it's not, you can open it for a little bit. You want to look? Cool. But close that bitch. Yeah. It's bright as fuck out yeah. there. Facts, facts, facts. What is this? I saw this post actually this morning. Woke up to this post. You you go lower, I go lower. You go low, I go lower. Okay. A- a- sending an email to the .edu address. Serious, your newest commit. I suggest you drug test your players. So and so, your newest commit sells, distributes, and uses marijuana on a daily basis. Damn. 
They what did he do to her? Did they told on you? What did he do to her, man? Look what she said after. If y'all knew what he did, y'all would understand why I took it this far. Well, what did he classic, do? Tell us. Yeah, it's classic. Nah, tell us. You gotta let us know. Wait, what is this? Absolutely this... no reason ever to make permanent decisions out for her. She's been. I'm so oh, confused right now. What is this? A Cowboys fan in distress? What does he have to say? <laughs> <laughs> He's been in distress for a decade. <laughs> <laughs> Just a Cowboys fan waiting to actually see a Super Bowl this century. Oh, <laughs> Broken fuck, Greg, dude. he's all sad. His name is Broken Greg is awesome. <laughs> I fucking love it. That's a good guy right now. That's a is that an email that somebody sent? Is that it what it is? It looks like. I wonder if she actually sent it. It's for the tweet, man. It might be for the tweet. Nah, people just be, be clicks. Yeah, people just be fucking baiting, Hey, bro. maybe though, man. You definitely, there's been girls out there that do some crazy shit like that. <sighs> that are like trying to ruin shit, you know what I mean? Crazy uh, stuff going on. That's there, wild, you though. What. That's, that's, that's insane. Just hey, tell us what he did. What did he do? What yeah, if he did some know. real crazy then, stuff? Then maybe, it was, maybe it was valid. Yep. Maybe it was valid. Maybe it was valid. Queen, go off. <laughs> <laughs> go off. All right. Well, oh, this is classic. This is rubbing classic. your fucking hands all over this shit. Hey, man, you smoke some. I'll smoke some Moroccan hash oil Bro, and all that. What you know? the oh, fuck? tip in the. Wait. Ew, dude, is this even gonna? Oh man, this ain't. This is like a classic IG video, like five years ago. What kind of the you know what fuck I mean? is this? Oh, Jackie 420, dude. Oh, dude, Fuck, legend. Yeah. Damn, I wonder what... He's in Vegas, man. We got to get him on the pod or something. He's so funny. Is he still making videos? I hope so. I hope so. He was like one of the people getting fucked with on IG so heavily compared to everyone Look at else, shit, man. That's awesome. I like the video 20 10 times awesome. more that he was on the video. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fuck, yeah. He's a classic IG guy. Yeah, he's Vietnamese, too. Shout out to the VM. Shout out to my Vietnamese brethren. You know what I mean? That's such a fucking silly ass joint. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Damn, it's all sticky and it's shit. Like I can not only burning imagine. at all. It's just sticking to your hand. <laughs> hey, it's smoking. It's nah, the weed. The weed. The weed is smoking. The weed is burning. The, I don't think the wax is burning much though. It's a classic Jack. A Sick video. video. Sick video. Jack A. Hit My us God, up, man. come on the podcast. He's got to be in Vegas still. I think. Yeah, I met him at an event. I met him and his lady at an event. Just nice people. Nice people. You know what it's I the mean? best kind of folks. That's what I'm saying. That just smoke a lot of that motherfucker. The ganja. Oh. You know that bud I just smoked, man? It's dropping real soon in California. There's a lot of Pine Park dropping in California, mm. man. Dropping over the next couple weeks. Very excited. We got a couple stores right here that are gonna get this new Pine Park, that new July Pine Park. Fresh batches. There's nothing like some fresh weed, man. If you're near one of these stores, make sure to show some love, man. Uh, we got Evergreen OC, Dr. Green Thumbs in San Diego. Herba Pico. I don't even know where that one is. That's a new one. I feel like I haven't shouted that one out, but Herba Pico, I like that. I guess in Pico, maybe. I'm assuming. Yeah, I'm off assuming. Of no, I'm assuming off of Pico Boulevard. The Woods WeHo, shout out, little lounge action. And we got a few cookie stores right here, man. I know you guys love the cookie stores. There are some good people out there. Cookies Fresno, Cookies San Bernardino, Cookies Hayward, and Cookies La Mesa. Cookies. All have some beautiful, beautiful stuff. We got Mankind. And Bored and Stoned. I've seen that one. Bored and Stoned's a cool one. The little NFT kind of vibe. Oh, shit. I almost knocked over it. your fucking bone. Dang. Crazy world out there. This ray gun's a little bit too bro, much to too, handle, yeah, man. Was, Holy I, I had some, shit. Had some recoil. I had some recoil, bro. It's got a nice little click to it as well. I oh, like shit. this thing, man. I've seen different colors. I've seen different like form factors on it. We need to get a Pine Park ray gun. Yeah. A Pine Park ray gun will be thick. Like black and green. Ooh. Damn. This is the way, man. This is the way. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Let's do it. Oh, I'm stoked. You taking one more dab? Did you just heat that up? I did. Oh, shit. I All right. I'll take another, another bong. Yeah, 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 yeah. Another 0.5 or yeah, 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 yeah. I'll grind it up this time, though, if we have a grinder on the table somewhere. Does grinding it up make a difference? Yeah, you can just like smoke all the way through a lot easier. Cause like oh, I tried to smoke that all the way through, but it was just a lot of plant material. That's why you said you, when you broke it up with your fingers. Yeah, it was a lot of plant uh, material, but it was a lot of terps. It was a lot of beautiful terps. You know what I mean? I can't be hating on the. Terps. <clears throat> Do you think it tastes better or worse, ground up or hand ground? Like, is there it better? tastes better hand ground for sure? Really? Because you're keeping a lot. Because I feel like a lot of the terps are lost to the grinder. I could be tripping though. I they're lost tripping. in the grinder. To oh, the like teeth, maybe to the cash catcher, or yeah, something like teeth, that cash catcher, fucking all that. It's touching more stuff than what your hands would. Yeah, touch. than just like hmm. they're just trying to tear it up and putting it in there. But I could be that wrong. There that needs to be a study. You know, we just needs to be federally, federally legal so we can get a lot of studies going on like that. Because I'm interested. You know what I mean? I want to study all the weed. Yeah, I want to know what's fucking going on out there. Hey, which one are you smoking on? <laughs> all upset 
Yeah, why were you mad at me? <laughs> Chill, My bro. bad. I was just very excited. I'm smoking that Mountain Man Melts. Nice. I don't know what flavor it was, but it was actually kind of delicious. I fuck with Mountain Man. Tropicana. Melts, man. That's why it was so yummy. Shout out to our good friend Jace, just doing good. Jason, yeah, love that guy. He's a good guy. Occasionally. Uh, boy. <laughs> that sh- man, I love- Had to make him giggle over there. Hey, listen. We appreciate you guys tuning in. Do another episode, episode 102. That's some good shit right there, man. Uh, damn, motherfucker. My bad. Damn. My bad. My bad. Nice. I know you were, my bad. I tried to back away from the camera. No, 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 no. That's nice. It wasn't a bad thing. That's what we like to hear. That's what we like to hear. <sighs> you like hot dabs or cold dabs? Like better. Uh, it's okay. If it's I've, like, I've would gone you on... rather reheat it and you could go through that process? Nah, right? nah, nah, nah. If I could only take like 600 degrees or 420, I take 600 degrees all day. Mm. Shit, if I can only take 700 or 4, I take the 700. Let's get high. Wow, 700 <laughs> over 400, like 20 degree dabs. It's just, I don't know, man. I'm trying to, I'm trying to smoke it. I don't. Yeah, know. yeah, yeah, yeah. I was on, a, I was on a. You gotta waste it wave. to taste it. Is that what they're saying? I don't want to waste it. Yeah, fuck that. I'm trying to get faded. Damn, smoke I'm the whole shit. It. I feel like it still tastes good, even if, if it's like really fire. You could take it hot and it still tastes good. Facts. But damn, you take a hot dab with some boo boo, ooh, like some mid. That's a bad time. Hot dab with some mid grade fucking wax is not a good day. Like that's that's a flashback to like 2010. That you don't, <laughs> you don't even want do you think it still gets you? Do you think hot dabs get you higher? Yeah. Wow. I think so. I wonder if that's a hot take. We gotta ask you guys in the comments, man. Do you think hot dabs get you higher? Do you personally feel like it, you know? Are you taking shit hot as fuck? Do you feel like it gets you a little crazier? I'm about to take another dab just to find out. Damn, like a super warm one? Feel that. Cheers, man. Glow it, glow it up. Yeah, I feel like the only reason it gets you higher is because you're smoking like every little bit of it. Look, I got it all. <coughs> See? <Stuck on>. See? <coughs> that, was a ha- that was a half gram for sure. <coughs> That first one, you might have smoked point two. <coughs> nah. For sure, sense. for sure. You I smoked I, all the flavor off of it, though. Definitely. I think I smoked more on the first one, man. I'm not going to lie. My lungs felt it more on the first one than I felt it on that one. And it's is, the same bud. But is it just because it was hand ground? Is it more harsh if it's hand ground? Does that make a difference? Maybe, I don't know the answer Maybe. To that. I mean, there's more plant material. Well, I don't know. There's don't more know the plant answer. material. It's just less ground up, I guess. I don't know. See, there's, you know maybe we got to figure out the study by ourselves. Fuck the scientists. We'll do it. We just let's do see. let's do videos like that on Pine Park. Little educational videos. Oh, to see like like if it's actually smoother if you yeah, grind yeah, it. Yeah, we'll wear lab it. coats and shit. Little pine park goggles. Coat. Damn, Loki. Damn, black Pine Park lab coat. It's shit because they're usually white. Oh, that sounds fucking gas. Yeah, I'm down yeah, 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 yeah. Little Xemer beer, little experiments. Oh my god. Let's do it. Thank you, everybody, for watching episode 102. Man, yes, you guys are the absolute best. We will see you next week for another week. In Pine Park after dark, we got a lot more shows coming. We got a lot more shits. He's coming. I'm very excited. And uh, make sure to tune in August 3rd as well. Michigan, any other places in between, any other places around it, please come out. Come smoke some weed. Test your lungs out, if you will. See what's good with that. Look at that. Come get your ass kicked at Mario Kart because you ain't winning. Damn, the Mario Kart Tim Challenge, bro. You can record beating Tim and fucking revel in it. That's a good victory right there. If you win, you're getting a prize, man. Getting surprises. Can they get a hint? Of Weed? The prize? Oh, of, of what? Of the prize? Oh, it's gonna be from Doghouse Pine Park. Yeah, it might, it might be merch. It might be weed. <clears throat> oh, it's like a random. Ooh, it, but it's a prize. Yeah. See, he's very excited. Maybe we'll we- see you guys August third, and we'll see you guys next week. Thank you, Tim, for being here. Anything to say to the people? We're chilling. Um, nah, man. It's been yeah. We're, I'm stoked. This was a banger episode. I'm so stoned right now. I took that damn hot as fuck, low key. Damn. Yeah, I can see it fucking <laughs> going off. The yeah, it's a little, yeah, it's a little crazy. fucked up. <laughs> crazy right now. Love you guys so much. Thank you all for tuning in. We'll see you next week on the next episode. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>